Hi everyone and welcome to today's practice. Today I have a 15 minute morning qigong for you. The exercises are easy to do and they're great to get you moving, breathing and get your day started feeling good. Go ahead and get ready and let's begin. But before we begin, if you like my YouTube videos, consider joining my membership site for more videos on energy, stress relief and sleep. And if you want to go deeper into your practice, you can join me live every Sunday on Zoom for a 45-minute Qigong session. You can find more information on how to join in the description below. Let's begin today's practice. We're going to begin with a quick warm-up. And today we're going to run or jump lightly on the spot. This exercise has similar effect to full body shaking but a little bit more fun, a little bit more dynamic. So if you're into that, have fun with it. And if you prefer the shaking, standing grounded on your feet, you can do that instead. So just keep it light. Allow your muscles to relax a little, to loosen up. Begin to open your joints. You can move around. Maybe do a little circle around your room. <laughs> And instantly it makes you want to smile. It makes you feel like you're doing something fun, playful, not taking ourselves seriously. Just a little bit of movement. Very, very good. Just a few more seconds, one more loop. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Good. Adjusting our alignment. So already you can feel a little shift. We're going to rub the hands. Rub vigorously. Developing that heat. I have Altai with me today. He is a little camera shy. He's rolling on the grass at the moment. Good, when your hands feel nice and warm, go ahead and knock or tap on the forehead and the temples. And then come down to the cheeks, the nose, the lips, the jaws. Good. Rub once more. Go ahead and tap the entire head. I do it with the fingertips. Moving from the hairline down towards the neck. We have a lot of meridians and points that join and connect in the head. So give it a good stimulation. Hop, 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 hop. Good. Once more. With an open palm, we're going to massage the neck until it feels nice and warm. And then do the same with the other hand. A little windy today. Good. And then find the C7 and knock. There's an acupressure point there. It's known as intersection of all young meridians in the body. It's a lot of young energy passing through, going to the head and back down. Good, relax. From here, adjusting your feet, make sure you're comfortable. And we're gonna open with nice full breathing. Hands come in, inhale, open your chest. Exhale, hands come down. Breathing in, inhaling always through the nose. Exhale, nose, mouth. Inhale. Exhale. Just simply observing your breath. Allowing your chest to open, your lungs to fill up. Exhaling, old, stagnant, chi out of your body. Inhale. 
Exhale. Once more. Exhale. And then open your hands out to the side. Come up on your toes. Exhale. Bend your knees. Sending your hips down. Tailbone pointing towards the ground. Inhale up. Exhale. Hello, buddy. You want to do some breathing? Inhale. Exhale. Exhale. Just paying attention to your breath. That's all you need to do. Coordinating breathing with the movement. And again, breathing in and breathing out. Good. From here, hands on the lower back. As always, a little bit on the hip rotation to prep and open the meridians that cross over the hips. It's good for the lower back, good for the kidney chi. Just keep it nice and round, connected the four points, front and back, left and right, making it into a nice round shape circle. Change direction. Very good. A few more. Mm -hmm. Coming back. You can quickly rub your lower back. Any opportunity you have to bring extra warmth and attention to the lower back, you take it. <laughs> good. Brush it down. Feet together. Coming down to the knees. Nice and slow. Keep your knees closer together. You don't have to do a big range of motion, just a little bit. Feet and the muscles are warming up, activating the joint fluid, hydrating, lubricating the joints. And then change direction. Very good. And then gently push your knees out to open and stretch the back or behind the knee and then bring it forward. Do that a few times. Again, focusing on warming up your knee joints. And once more. Out. In. Head up. Very good. Adjusting your feet so they remain nice and parallel. And let's do the hip opener. Get yourself on one leg. Open touch. Bring it back. Open touch. Bring it back. Find your center. Align yourself. The knee on the supporting leg is a little bit bent. Remember, we never stand on locked knees in Qigong or Tai Chi. And once more. Open. Bring it back. Shift the weight. So you're taking your time to invest in quality here. So rather than having this big range of motion and at the same time you're falling off to the side. It's better to do a smaller range of motion, do it daily, do it consistently, and working on your balance, working on your alignment.
and the range of motion will come. The mobility, flexibility of your hips will gradually improve with a regular practice once more. Good. And then shake it loose all the way from your hip down, down, down to your toes. Very good. Okay. And again, we're coming back to our stance, unlocking the joints, relaxing through the lower back, opening through the spine. Take a nice deep breath in through the nose. And easy long exhale down. Following your hands, lean forward, connecting to the earth, to the ground, reaching through the fingertips, opening through the spine. And then inhale as if you're gathering something, filling up your entire body, and send it out to the sky, connecting to the energy of the sky through your palms. Inhale, bring it down. Exhale, surrender, release. Lengthening forward. Inhale, come up. Exhale. Breathing in. Breathing out. Take your time. Breathing in. Coordinating breathing here. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. What we're doing here is we're opening and stretching the front of the body and all the meridians that run at the front. And then we're also stretching all the meridians that run along the back and down the back of the legs. Breathing in. Breathing out. One more time, breathing in. Hello, sunshine. And then I exhale, breathe out, letting your hands come down. Very good. From here, we're going to turn to the back. I want you to spiral your hands in and just turn to the back. Stretching through your entire spine and then release, coming back to center. And again, just light twist towards the sides of the legs. I think Alta is stalking someone, must be a squirrel. Release. And again, turn into the back. Release. I want you to feel how your whole body is like a rubber or a towel, just rotating. And then release, feel the energy moving. We go again to the back. Return. Last one. Very good. Step out to the side, inhale, open your arms, exhale down the center. And again, inhale, open. Draw in fresh chi, fresh oxygen into your lungs, exhale. Breathing in. Breathing out, palms facing the ground as we're guiding and gathering the chi in the lower belly, below the diaphragm, a major energy center in our body, passing through the mind, through the heart, and into the belly. Breathing in. Centering your thoughts, centering your mind, 
grounding your energy, preparing for a calm day ahead. And once more, breathing in, breathing out. We close by focusing our attention, guiding our concentration and awareness to the lower belly. Very good. Thank you very much. I hope this was exciting. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed yourself. I hope you enjoyed the exercises. A little playful start and then some stretches, some breathing. So let me know how you feel if you're ready to face the day. And as always, don't forget to support us, subscribe to the channel so I can continue releasing free Qigong videos on YouTube. Until next time, I wish you great health, keep well, and I'll see you in the next video.